what's up youtubers and xda this is abdroid slash abdroid sound here with how to flash rom called ics objection which is made by me for this guy sorry can't keep it on galaxy note by samsung for AT&T I don't know if you can see it or not but I've seen so many people on my thread having trouble on how to install so today or soon before I post this video I will have update out just one update which is gonna be all you need to flash so just if you are my ROM, you can go into CWM recovery by two ways. Reboot through your 14 mod system UI and press recovery and OK or through extender power menu reboot OK or manual. both button and the power so all three buttons keep folding it first vibrate let go the power button second vibrate Samsung right there now let go the other two buttons you will be in the CWM clockwork mar recovery right here first of all what, what do you need to do is wipe data factory reset this is touch recovery and it has a lot of problems <laughs> believe me or not I really don't care it has problems which is problems there that's it so wipe data t three times please do it if you don't do this the way I tell you to and if you skip steps and come back complaining me and I'll say you because I really don't care about you no more wipe cashier three times that's why I'm telling people to flash dark side cashier wipe because that thing not only f wipes cashier but it also fixes permission but some dumb asses things that I don't know what I'm doing and they're right whatever you guys can do whatever you want but this is how I like to do stuff so find your ROM wherever you have it this is internal that is external I have it in external double tap it find it says 4 for me but you will have number 2 so it's gonna start flashing and meanwhile I will tell you some of the features some of the stuff I did to my ROM first of all I would like to thank Design Gears for getting the leak him and his unknown leaker who leaks IC, ICS ice cream sandwich for skyrocket and note second I'd like to thank all the XDA and whole world <laughs> This is no, not in particular order. Flap checks. Thanks a lot for the kernel, which enables boot animation and boot sound, and I have both of them in this ROM. I have SD card speed tweaks, smoothness tweaks, 14 more toggles. The ROM is supercharged. Transference less OSP lock screen. Volume wake button. CRT of animation contacts tab in phone APK or phone application it zips on the boot there is shutdown animation uh, there are tons of ringtones UI tones and alarms and notification tones there are some SGS3 applications
comes with Sony Bravia engine it's deep loaded it has heavy air blocking battery saver tweaks touch responsiveness smooth scrolling smooth UI tweaks it ra there raises JPEG quality deep loaded zip aligned the docs routed some ICS applications DSP manager 3G Twix HD YouTube lag free AT&T visual voicemail has a RAM script custom RAM script and these are the features some of them which I might have forgotten well, what can you remember? It's about 5.25 a.m. If you click below in description, you will be right here. This is me, Abdur Sound, slash Abdur. And you will be downloading my ROM somewhere right here. These are all the features. This is the steps you might want to follow or you just follow my video. Now, it's good idea to wipe cache advanced web delve cache double tap it come on it didn't work well, whatever you're supposed to do it or you should do it now press reboot breaked my phone oh my god it didn't. Don't worry, guys. I'm just kidding. This is what happens when you start doing all nighters and start cooking this wrong. It's fun. Same time. Get you. That is the boot animation. And whatever the lady was saying, that's the boot animation sound or boot sound this is up there video guys it takes time on flashing you should be taking time because this will really depend on how your daily driver aka the ROM you flash is gonna work out with issues or without issues Cap lights are on, so should be vibrating any moment, and then we'll be starting. So we will wait patiently. I recommend you guys to wait at least least a minute after it's reboots. Just let it settle down for like two two minutes. After two minutes, go ahead and start doing what you need to do. Now it's installing apps. That's CWN GMI. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Adobe Reader. Now next is gonna be Quick Pick. It's gonna go fast, watch. Tighten them back up. That's it. And you have now successfully booted. Uh, you have two options. If you wanna know more, ROM review will be coming up. So watch that. The 4G LTE will take one or two seconds to come up so thank you for watching my videos guys and I will see you on the next one which is gonna be review for this ROM
stay tuned and stay connected so we can watch it later